And I really want to thank the Migos, not for being in the show, but for making Bad and Bougie. Like, that's the best song <laughs> ever. Sunday night, they get an unexpected shout out at the Golden Globes, and by Monday afternoon, they've landed the number one song in the country. Congratulations to Migos, who along with Lil Uzi Vert, swore their very first Billboard Hot 100 number one, as Bad and Bougie takes down Ray Shermer and Gucci Mane's Black Beatles, which falls to number two. And speaking of Beatles, I think they're the Beatles of this generation, and they don't get a lot of respect. Glover continued his praise, going so far as to say, And honestly, that song's just fly. Like, it, there's no better song to have sex to. Raindrop, drop, drop top. The trio from Georgia were quick to offer up their gratitude for the kind words on Twitter, while also reminding us that amidst all this craziness over Bad and Bougie, they're about to bless us with a full-length album by month's end, as Culture drops January 27th. Now, if you just can't wait until then, or are maybe new to the Migos craze and want to see what all the hype is about, the rappers dropped a brand new music video for their track T-Shirt Friday, available now over on their YouTube channel. Hey, mama told me, hey, not to sell work. Mama, 17, five, same color T-shirt. We've got more on Donald Glover's big night at the Globes, along with full details on the rest of this week's Hot 100 Top 10 on Billboard.com, and I'd love to talk more about this one down in the comments. The Beatles are pretty high praise as far as music goes. Do you think Migos are on that level yet? I want to know your thoughts, so let me know as always. And until next time, for Billboard News, I'm Kevin Kenny.